Muppet players are proud to present a little-known classic of Arthur Conan Doyle entitled Sherlock Holmes and the Case of the Disappearing Clues. Sherlock Holmes here. What's in there? Oh, Mr. Holmes, I'm so glad you're here. It's murder, Mr. Holmes. Murder. Just calm down, my dear lady. Dr. Watson and I will have this case solved in no time, right, Watson? Of course. Holmes can solve any crime by a simple process of deduction. Mm. Yes, sir. The body of Lord Bottomley is right over there. <laughs> Don't look, Watson. It's too horrible to gaze upon. What manner of fiend could have done this? Actually, I'm fielding the butler. Lord Bottomley lies over there. He's been shot, Oh. Yes, yes. Hmm, give me a moment. Mm -hmm. Of course. I arrest Fielding the butler for the murder of Lord Bottomley. Amazing. Preposterous. Elementary. The butler's fingerprints are on this glass. Ah. Here's a photo of the butler committing the murder. Ah. The weapon in question, registered in the butler's name. And finally, an eyewitness, the maid, who will seal his doom. Excuse me, miss. Ah! 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 Your deduction on the face of the evidence brings us to the only possible conclusion, and that is that the butler did it. But, but Holmes, there is no evidence, so your logic is wrong. Uh, logic is never wrong, Watson. If there is no evidence that the butler did it, and I certainly didn't do it. Then the inescapable conclusion, Watson, yes, yes. is that you're the murderer. <laughs> hmm. mm, it's tough. Well, uh, now the inescapable conclusion is that uh, with no evidence and no killer, mm. there was no murder. Ha. Ah. <laughs> Gesundheit. 